I'm live in the danger room. I need some some theme music. There we go. Every good hero should have some. You man, one top live in the danger room with my man Bizarre. Yo, yo, yo. It's going down. All right. Now we was just talking about oh, that. Eyes on me. Oh, start. Go ahead, set it off, man. <laughs> <laughs> You want to do a verse? You want to kick a verse? Oh, man. I'm going to get them warmed up. I'm going to do a little more talking first. All right. Yes. Do it. So we're going to get into, um, what are we talking about? Uh, we got well, we got another single. Okay. Now, what was the name of that? Sing- the name of the single ne- coming up next? Oh, this ain't a single, man. It's just, uh, this is like a special song you just uh, dedicate to Toledo, man. It's dedicated to my city, Toledo. Yeah. It's, it's, uh, it's, it's, you know, it's called Toledo. Actually, uh, I spent some time out here. Um, I stayed here, what, about three or four years ago. Okay. I had a crib out mommy. Oh, okay. I had a little... Out the way fia- spot. Yeah, yeah. I had a little fiance out here. Shout out to Cabbage, mm-hmm. Pork, all my boys. Oh, uh, okay. Mike Flames, you know, yeah. Steve yeah. Frost, everybody <laughs> helped me down. Shout out to Geno's. <laughs> Geno's! It's about the piece. I, I came from. <laughs> and you were, you were telling me about another place, right? Yeah, San Marcos. We're going there after we leave here. And they got tacos? Yeah, it's talk about my my, uh, my my um my manager uh, Jeff Salsa. He's a uh, cholo from the South. Come on, <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's from, his manager's from Toledo, yeah, so yeah. I felt some type of way about bizarre telling me about my own city. You know what I'm saying about something I had yet. Right, right. <laughs> but that that brings it all together. Yeah, it's slapping, man. But uh, yeah, man. Um, they can also get the mixtape uh, Lace Blunts too, March second on LiveMixtapes.com. It's Free, okay. You know what I'm saying? Uh, that piff, bizarre's world. Dot net. Yeah. You know, basically, you know, everywhere. What's your social media game looking like? Oh mm-hmm. man, I, I gotta. You know what I'm saying? I gotta step my game up, man. Yeah. It's cool. It's cool. I see. I see you doing big I, things I, I on got Twitter. Like Forty thousand followers on Twitter. Man. Yeah, yeah you know we working. Yeah, we, you working. You verified. Um, I, How did that I feel? just gotta. <laughs> that was cool. I just gotta give my game up, man. You know, I just. I, I gotta understand the whole concept about it, you know what I'm saying? It's really about, you know, telling people everything you're doing. I just, mm-hmm. I just took a sh. You <laughs> right. know what I'm saying? They wanna know what flavor, right? You know? So give it to them, man. Yeah, hey, you know, you're basically telling your whole life on, on Twitter. So. Right. I mean, you know, for the crazy records anyway. Right. So just right. go crazy on the social, you know? Right. I'm just saying every all type of stuff that's going to just get me in prison. This might be my last interview. <laughs> <laughs> well, come on, for, pray for me to lace blunts. I mean, I'm pray for me in prison. <laughs> <laughs> now let, let's talk about the lace blunts. What's the blunt laced with? I mean the mixtape. Who oh, laced oh, the mixtape? <laughs> oh man, uh, who laced the mixtape, man? Uh, I gotta, man. I, you know, for some reason, you know, you know, I do a and work for Shady Records too. So right, who's gonna get into that? So uh, I just, you know, what I'm saying, my email was just flooded with people, just young homie producers sending me beats all the time. Yeah. So. I don't discriminate, man, about, you know, who got hot music. If you got some hot, man, you know, send it to me, man. I will, you know, give you a shot. Okay. So how long have you been to A&R? Uh, probably, like, probably like a year now, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I got like two beats on Slaughterhouse last album, a um, couple on Marshalls. Not his last album, the album before that. So, okay. you know what I'm saying? I'm just, you know, that's my boy, man. You know, I got an ear for music, man. So I'm just constantly, you know, bringing him, you know, a lot of producers that you know that's hot. Mm-hmm. You've been, you've done a lot of you've done a lot of projects in the past few years. Right, right. Do you and, and I see you doing behind the scenes work too. Right. Do you prefer the spotlight or you see yourself behind the scenes more? Uh, both, man. You know what I'm saying both. Uh, I, you know, I, I like the spotlight. You know, spotlight's cool. Sometimes it get annoying, mm-hmm. but you know, sometimes being at home get annoying too. You True. Know what I'm saying <laughs> just. The regular guy syndrome is, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Who, I mean, who wants to be a regular guy? Like, right, right. Hey, sometimes so, it's not that bad after you go through I know, it. but, you know, after when you're a rapper, man, it's like you, you, you kind of fiend for the role, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. After you're home for a couple of weeks, you're like, okay, wh- what am I doing? Because I don't have a nine to five. Nine right. to five is my music, so right. getting up and not, you know, not yeah. doing nothing every day, man, make you just... Want to come to Toledo. <laughs> and that's how it all started four years ago. <laughs> so you're back in the D now, right? Yeah. Yep, yep. Right. Back in the, between, from from here, Detroit and Atlanta. You know, so I got a house in Atlanta, too. Okay. Well, well uh, how do you feel about, you know, a lot of people, they just moved to Atlanta and stay. Right. But are you, you stay rooted in the D? Yeah, man, I, I got to stay rooted, man. You know what I'm saying? I got to, 
Chief the Grimes in Atlanta is, is is too nice. You know, people, you know, he's speaking and smiling and mm, stabbing. Yeah, you know, helping <laughs> you out with your tires. Yeah, you know, yeah, used to that. You yeah. from Detroit, right? So I, I really like the both. I like Atlanta for the, you know, to get away from the D. You know what I'm saying? I might get stabbed and killed any second. But <laughs> but that's know, home though. Yeah, it's home yeah. at the same time. I feel too. it. Right. Now, now back to the lace blunts. I, I can't get over it. Um, <laughs> I mean, what about artists like guest appearances? Who what producers uh, laced it? Uh, you know, I, I got my uh, of course my cousin over here, Dub Music. Shout to Dub you know, Music. Shout to Dub Music. You can get at him at Dub Music on Facebook. Give me some beats. Uh, I got my boy Big T, the battle rapper behind you. Okay. From Chicago, shout out to Big T. If you let, if you mess with battle rap, you have heard of Big T before. And uh, if you don't mess with battle rap, you will. You will. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, I got Ritz uh, on there. I got uh, some uh, I'm doing with Twister. Um, uh, who else? Uh, I'm waiting for currency to send something back. You know, I, I got a lot of people on there, man. You know, I know, I know a lot of people in the industry, man. That's a good look. So, you know, just okay. trying to stay afloat. If, if you could have one feature that overall that you wanted on that uh, on the album project. Oh, uh, actually, I, I got a kid. What's the kid name from Toledo that's on the album? Um. Ah, uh, I forget his name. I just show you. The movie Mel. I give the rappers a chance. I know and you got a song Toledo song, coming up. Know. We just shot a video too. Movie wow. Mel. Uh, shout out to movie Mel though. Okay. Shout out to Moby Mel from Toledo. He just shot a video, okay. you know, with me. And actually, the dude is his artist. Chris. His name is Chris. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> it's, a, it's, a it's a start. Come on, man. Come on, Chris. Man. That's it. It's a start. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We well, got to be working in the morning. Well, <laughs> <laughs> right, right. His right. name is Chris. Work. He got to work. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, let's jump to the album. What's the album title? The album title is called Eleven. Eleven. Yeah. Now, how far are you along with that? Is it like uh, like seventy percent? You know what I'm saying? And uh, I know you gonna ask me why is it called eleven? You know, because everybody said they turned up, they on ten. So you gotta be. Hey, come on, up, man. You okay. know, I feel you. I feel you. <laughs> One time, eleven. See, I see, the, I see how this goes right here. <laughs> All right. So, so what features you got on the album? Same, same. Yeah, people, King same Gordy, team. Big T's on there. Uh, Reds. Um, uh, I, I'm out of, I'm drawing a blank right now. Rehab. Who? Rehab. Oh, uh, Rehab. I did a song with Rehab. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Uh, man. Okay. So we can expect Ooh. some tricks. Who that? Jay Z. Young Z. Young Z. That's a big difference in budget right there. <laughs> I'm just guessing. I'm just guessing. <laughs> All right, well, if you could get one feature, though, on right. the album, who would it be? Anybody. Uh, older, you know, older, new, dead, or alive. How about that? Uh, I, I want a song with uh, Pharrell. 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 That's a good choice. Pharrell and maybe Missy. Ah, you want double. You want yeah. them both on the same yeah. song. Yeah, that's never going to happen, man. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Shout out to Jerry Springer, too, man. We got, we got him on the album, too. Word? Yeah. Real talk? Yeah, we got a song called Jerry Springer. Ah, uh, okay. About to, about to shoot a video soon of that, too. Man, you always going after pop culture, man. <laughs> you just pick one person and laser in on it, man. Yeah, but Jerry Springer, he down with us.